Hello, I'm Julian from Bishop Sullivan, the letting specialist in Brighton Hove, and this week I've got four tips on how to help pet owners find a rental property. Now, since the tenant fees bill came into place on the 1st of June, tenants have generally been very happy. You got no fees, reduced five week deposit, and only a small uplift in rent. But not everybody is happy. So before the 1st of June, approximately 10% of landlords would accept pets. Many required an eight week deposit rather than six due to the high risk of damage or extra wear and tear. And often an end of tenancy fumigation at the tenant's cost was required to protect the next occupants from little visitors. Neither have been possible since the 1st of June. Now, according to the property industry, I only 2% of advertised property now accepts pets. So what to do if this is you? Well, firstly, offer a higher rent, for example, £25 per calendar month, and that covers p- potential extra wear and tear and damage. Number two, ask the agent if they offer a zero deposit scheme, which tends to cover six to eight weeks deposit. Now, watch my 14th of May YouTube video for tips on that. Number three, create a pet CV showing recent vaccinations, previous deposit return confirmations, previous reference reports, and you can ask your agent for a copy all to build confidence and get you ahead of the rest. And number four, definitely do not keep your pet a secret. This would likely be a breach of terms and can lead to a problematic tenancy, possibly even a section eight notice as a worst case scenario. Now I hope this has been of use and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more relevant content. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Julian from Bishop Sullivan.